assalamu alaikum uh, welcome back to my youtube channel hope you're all well and enjoying good health and uh, changing weather and feeling beautiful as usual so this video is going to be about um, my jewelry collection um, that includes all my jewelry all sort of jewelry it would include my high end very pricey jewelry at the same time um, the gifts i have received from friends and family and uh, all those makeup um, sorry I have to talk about makeup and all those uh, jewelry items that I have purchased from time to time from here and there and just you know very um, not very expensive pieces as well but uh, all those uh, jewelry pieces that has some sort of memories attached to it so uh, we'll begin with uh, sharing the uh, fine jewelry collection I have so let's start the first three pieces of jewelry I'm going to share with you are the rings I'm wearing right now so if you see this ring, uh, this is basically uh, a gold ring, which I bought very long ago. And this is related and uh, uh, it has a lot of memories and I call it my success ring. So I always wear this. This is, I ex passed some exams and my, uh, my dad and my Taya gave me some money. I bought this ring from that money and that's why this is so special to me. This other ring, which you can see, it's a Cartier ring and I bought it from London and uh, uh, I just love wearing it, in, especially in this finger. And uh, and the next rings, actually all these rings I'm going to show you are my purchases from London. And uh, this is a Gucci ring. Uh, it's very, very uh, delicate and it's a very nice, cute ring. And this one, this is a very small ring. It has two uh, stones on the other, on each side. And this is from uh, Louis Vuitton. And uh, these are the rings I'm wearing right now. These are the hairstyles I bought from, I don't remember which shop, but some very non-pricey and just the casual ones. And these are the earrings I um, got from my sister. She had these very nice, uh, I think she bought it from Maldives or Sri Lanka. It's very, very, very nice, delicate pieces. And talking about uh, jewelry, so this is the watch I'm wearing right now. This is from Michael Gores and uh, my mom brought it for me from US. Um, all right, so this is the special box I have. This has all my fine jewelry and uh, not the gold one, but the uh, branded ones. So one by one, I'll share uh, some of my jewelry with you. Um, these are my special earrings, uh, special, all my jewelry special, but uh, some uh, rings collection. These are my studs. And this portion holds all my uh, special pretty necklaces. So let's uh, see all the jewelry one by one. So the next first necklace I would share is this gold necklace uh, with uh, Allah's name on it. And uh, I don't know where I got it from. I am sure this must be one of the gifts from my mom because uh, uh, that's uh, I think that's how it is. The rest of it uh, I'm not going to remove from my box. This is my Swarovski uh, swan necklace. It's very, very, very pretty and very close to my heart. This is a complete set. I bought this from uh, Turkey uh, in this year. And this has very nice ear studs with it. Oh. These are the ear uh, studs, you could say, or earrings with the same necklace. And it has a very delicate same matching ring as well. So it's a complete set. And... Uh, this one is what I bought from Gavadar uh, last year. I was there for some work and uh, this is a Chinese word. I'm not sure what it means, but it means something good. And uh, this is another necklace. Uh, this is my mom gave it to me. It's 18 karat gold and it's with emeralds. And uh, it has uh, matching earrings as well that I'll show you later. And this is my black uh, swan, uh, black Swarovski. And uh, I'm just love with it. I am in love with this one as well. And this one is, um, I think, I don't remember where I bought it from. Maybe Dubai? Or, but it's very nice as well. It has the matching earrings. You can see it here. These are the matching earrings that uh, comes with this uh, necklace. So when we have opened it, these are some other pieces of jewelry. These are very uh, pretty blue stones. It's not very expensive ones. And these two, I bought it from local Pakistan store. So uh, this brings us to the next uh, uh, session of my um, 
jewelry which is uh, these are the swan uh, studs oh not studs the very delicate pretty uh, earrings i bought it from uh, uh, wales and uh, this is again this is from uh, uh, these are some gold uh, plated uh, earrings uh, these are what i got from windsor uh, the where where the queen's castle is i was shopping with there on some day and again these are my swan black swans again i am in love with swans and i have a lot of jewelry that has the swan designs i mean it includes earrings necklaces and uh, of course the recent purchase is a swan ring as well look at this pretty beautiful swans dancing around my ring my finger and uh, the next uh, jewelry i'll show you is this is again i bought it from london and uh, this is from a uh, guest store these are two very pretty uh, studs and look really classy when you're wearing these and the next jewelry collect pieces i'm going to show you is um, this is a chanel uh, earring this used to be two <laughs> And I used to wear it here on my uh, second uh, uh, ear piercing, but I lost one of these, so I, I really feel sad about this, but I've lost it already. I think I, I have lost a lot of earrings. I mean, I don't know. I'm just wearing one and the other one is gone. And when I look for it, I never found it. Poor me. So the next collection of jewelry is from the same uh, jewelry box. These are some uh, pearl pearls with very delicate uh, design of this earring this is my sister uh, gifted to me this is by a pakistani designer very very uh, uh, pretty jewelry she makes a very very pretty and uh, classy jewelry and uh, she bought some pairs from a exhibition it was a jewelry exhibition by this um, i forgot her name but it's a very very famous uh, jewelry designer and uh, she bought it for me as a gift and this ring it's a very pretty uh, flowery black ring and uh, which i plan to wear on some formal dinner or somewhere with a very nice black out black outfit and uh, this is what my sister uh, gave it to me oh yeah my sister give, gives me a lot of jewelry this is a ring it's a very old ring 2014 i bought it from dubai and it's an egyptian ring i think egyptian or moroccan i think it's egyptian or moroccan i don't know but it's very pretty, very delicate, and um, I've been saving it for a long time from all my friends, uh, sisters especially, <laughs> because everybody wants to, you know, <laughs> like, everybody likes this ring and everybody wants to have it. All right, but this is the next jewelry piece. I bought it from Lahore, and uh, it's a very classy piece of jewelry. Uh, it's from uh, Dupatta Gali. Uh, what do you call it? Liberty Dupatta Gali. All right, the next piece of jewelry. This is a very pretty ring. I never had this uh, color, uh, colored stone. So this is from Maria B. And this is a birthday present from my younger sister. This ring, uh, this is a very pretty blue stone ring. I bought it from uh, somewhere in Lahore. And this ring, oh my God. This ring has my heart. This is a very pretty sort of a bridal wedding sort of ring that I usually wear on weddings and you know special occasions and this is this looks so classy so classy I just can't express how pretty it looks it completes all your hand jewelry if you're just wearing this one ring this ring I think I bought, locally bought it from Lahore it's very you know delicate yet very classy and this brings us to the last ring of this box this is a green ring this used to be very golden and uh, uh, I bought it from Liberty, uh, from the Patagali, and uh, I wore it for like once or twice, and my sister took it to England, and <laughs> she kept it for years and years and years, and now she actually had a real stone with the, she ordered a gold ring with a real stone, real emerald, and now she has it in gold, and uh, she returned my ring. Thank you, my sister. So since I moved uh, to Riyadh recently and I don't have all my formal jewelry collection here, the ones I wear on weddings, because obviously I'm not going to, if I go to weddings here, this would be a different sort of weddings because it's not Pakistani classy, um, you know, all those jewelry, make jewelry and fancy weddings here. 
so that's why I didn't bring a lot of my uh, jewelry collection, the wedding jewelry collection. I only have these two earrings, uh, the one pair of earrings, I would say. Um, this is what my sister gave it to me. Oh yeah, I have a lot of gifts from my sisters. So this is a very beautiful champagne uh, uh, earrings, and uh, this looks very classy with sarees. And uh, even when uh, uh, I can even wear it with shalwar kameez for a formal dinner or somewhere, and it's very pretty. And uh, it, it's a kind of an antique uh, design. And uh, the uh, these uh, this color actually goes with everything. I mean, that's the benefit of neutral shades. So now I'm going to share with you my uh, necklace collection and uh, the ones I usually wear at work or casual as well and semi-formal as well. So this is a necklace and this is by LV. Uh, of course, I bought it from my recent visit in um, London, the UK. So this is a very special delicate earring, uh, sorry, uh, necklace. Most of the times I wear it with the uh, guest earrings with the same design of, uh, you know, stone lock. Uh, the second piece of jewelry, the necklace is this white necklace. It's not a white, it's a fawn sort of a necklace. Uh, and I wear it with the, some formal clothes, means office clothes, most of the times. The next is a very pretty, very, very dear to me. It's an Afghani necklace with the coins in it. It's a green necklace. Uh, and sometimes I wear it like this, it shows only the coins and uh, sometimes like the green one. So it, it looks really classy and uh, honestly speaking, I wear it at work as well. The next is a new collection. Uh, it's a, it's has been added recently to my uh, collection. It has, it's a Swarovski necklace and it's what my mom gave it to me. She had two, she had blue and red and uh, I, bought, I got the red one and my sister got the um, blue one. All right, this is from Accessorize, and uh, again, I, I usually wear it with my office suits because it looks very, um, it goes with a lot of colors, whites, blacks, and grays. And this is what I bought from Dubai. I don't remember the shop where I bought it from, but it looks very nice with, you know, uh, uh, with a lot of things. Mostly I wear it with white uh, t-shirts and, you know, when going out with friends or informal and fun mode. And then is the next necklace. It's a very classy necklace. I got it from Lahore. You tie it like this. And it's a very pretty stone here. And it looks really, really classy. And of course, it's my, again my office uh, jewelry. Uh, office jewelry. I mean, it's included in my office jewelry. And the next necklace is by Next. Uh, this is a simple uh, three layer necklace, chain necklace, which usually you see with a lot of, uh, it's, it's a lot in trend and I used to wear it a lot uh, with very plain clothes like blacks or whites or any plain colors and uh, it's also in the list of sometimes in my office wear. The next piece of jewelry I'm going to share with you is uh, uh, since I work as a blogger on Instagram as well so I got these pieces from a, a, a jewelry store uh, based in Italy I think Italy somewhere in Europe and this, is, this comes with this very uh, delicate uh, um, bracelet and a matching, uh, matching necklace. So basically they sent it as a gift for me with uh, these earrings. Very pretty, very, very, very pretty and very stylish earrings. Like this. So this is a pearl set with pretty pearls. It's very, very trendy and very class, very modern. The next piece of jewelry is this very pretty uh, Louis Vuitton uh, necklace and uh, it looks very, very uh, cute and delicate on your neck. I love wearing hoops and everybody loves wearing hoops and uh, different designs of hoops uh, other than, you know, the round ones. I wear these uh, square ones and uh, this these ones with the pearls. Actually, I'm a pearl person. A lot of my jewelry has pearls. I mean, I just love pearls and stones. So you'll see a lot of lot more pearls coming soon. The pieces I'm going to share with you are my bracelets. And uh, let's look at them. This is a very pretty uh, bracelet. This has uh, Aital Kursi written on it. And I bought it from a local online store in Lahore. And it looks very pretty 
on your hand, first thing. And secondly, whenever I feed it, I feel so protected. I mean, I just love this one. I mean, I feel so good about when I'm wearing this one. And uh, the second, I don't remember where I got it from. It's a elastic one. It's a very, very old bracelet. I still have it with me. I mean, I sometimes wear it my, you know, watches and I still don't remember where it come, came from. And the next bracelet I have, uh, it's a set of three uh, karas or uh, bracelets, you could say. This is, I got it from Khadi. And so many friends and family, everybody asks where, where I got it from. And if I can find a similar for them, similar piece of jewelry for them, I never found it again. It was, it's a rare uh, piece and it's so pretty and I just love it. And uh, this is one of the uh, bracelets I recently got. It's with black stones and uh, I got a friend of uh, a cousin, my, one of my cousins, she gave it to me. And this is the bracelet I made it. Uh, I think it was on a Gucci um, uh, perfume. It was, it was a design <laughs> on the Gucci perfume. I took it out and I made a bracelet for myself. And this is another bracelet. It's with blue stones. It's a Turkish bracelet. And uh, this is what my sister gave it to me as a gift uh, when she was visiting Turkey once. So this is a very delicate, very pretty, and it's a rose gold blue bracelet. The next piece of jewelry I'm going to share with you is also very, very special. And uh, this is basically, uh, it's a gold uh, with stones embedded. And uh, this is like a, a hoops. And uh, it's a very, it's a bit expensive as well. And uh, this is a Roman earrings and a friend of mine got it from uh, New York, from a Met uh, Museum. And uh, what they are doing, they are actually creating replicas for the uh, jewelry, the uh, old uh, people, I mean, the people in history used to wear. They create uh, replicas of the jewelry in the uh, museum and uh, you can actually buy these. So it's a very pretty and looks very, very classy and very Roman. So the next piece of jewelry are the my, my collection of pearl earrings. This is one of the sets. I wear it a lot. I think I had a necklace as well, but somehow I lost it. Uh, I don't have it anymore. This is another set of uh, pearls. These are Belgian pearls. And this is one of my friends from Netherlands brought it for me. And uh, it really looks classy. It is very classy. And another set of pearl earrings, which I wear almost every week or every other day. It's a very, very pretty design with the uh, uh, pearls in it. And another very trendy uh, earrings. This is the half flower earrings and I really love this one as well. And uh, I have another, uh, these are like the hanging earrings. And it's also, it looks very pretty as well. And uh, these are the green leaves, leaves earrings. I know it's 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 very delicate as well, and uh, another pearls. Oh yeah, I have a lot of pearls. This is the pearls. This also looks very nice. And all these, the ones I'm showing you, I ordered from a local um, store, uh, online store from Pakistan. And I'm going to show you these ones. These are the very pretty gold uh, earrings, and you could. Uh, wear it like formally and semi-formally as well not obviously no i cannot wear these at work but the next piece of jewelry i'm going to show you is in a bit trouble uh see these are the earrings these are blue stones it comes with a necklace this is a necklace and this is the ring but uh the chain is tied here and i'm trying to open it but it put, it's taking a little longer so I'm just going to show it like this. So these are the earrings uh, and the necklace. It, it looks really pretty as well. So I do it with the, by the way, I have a good news. So while I was actually going through uh, showing you my jewelry, I found my Chanel. Oh my God, I feel so happy. Now I can wear it again. Thank you so much for this video. I mean, watching this video because you made it lucky. All right, I have another piece of uh, jewelry from Pakistan and this is a nose ring. Uh, Let's wear it while I'm making this video. How do I look? So usually I wear it on weddings and you know where I really want to look very something. All right, so the next set is, uh, so the blue one I just showed you, I got it from Dubai and uh, 
Dubai. I got it from Dubai. And again, this is again I got it from Dubai. Dubai. This comes with these delicate uh, uh, ear studs or ear something. And also this pretty beautiful ring. Very beautiful ring. All right, so the next uh, jewelry is also from a very special person. I really love her and I'm sure she, when she will watch this video, she will know what I'm talking about. She, this is from Anam. She's a very sweet friend of mine. She gave it uh, to me. It was not on my birthday. It was, she just wanted to give something to me. <laughs> and this is what she gave me on my birthday. So these are pink stones and this is from a very uh, nice Pakistani brand, Tesoro. I love this. And I wear it a lot of time because it looks really classy and pretty. So I have shown you a lot of my uh, jewelry and this is the last box that's left and the, these are all rings and uh, these are the collection of rings I, I bought from time to time and uh, it's very very uh, classy pieces and uh, look at this this is a very pretty golden circle this is again a swan or a bird and this is a very golden pretty ring and uh, uh, I am I think the video has gone a bit long so I'm just going to be a little quick. These are some very nice pieces that I mix and match and uh, wear. And uh, it always, always looks very classy. This is. And if you ask me where I got it from, I have no idea. Because uh, I just keep on collecting rings. And uh, the sources could be any local Pakistani store or uh, some online stores as well. This is a chain ring. It also looks very pretty, very classy. And uh, this is again another delicate uh, stone ring. And this, this looks very pretty, by the way. This is a very pure gold ring. And uh, again, another comes with a stone. And uh, these are my special earrings with the matching green uh, heart-shaped necklace that I showed you. This is from my mom. And it's 18 karat gold with the real... Uh, emerald in it and uh, here is another uh, ring which I have worn so many times and that it has changed its color but still I love wearing it it's like it was a golden one now it's a bronze one still I wear it so much and these are my ear studs which I used to I wear it here sometimes because I don't want to get ear piercing here so I just wear it like this and another piece of ring uh, which looks very classy like it's one ring but it has two two rings something and again this this ring it's very very pretty and it's a green uh, stone ring and uh, last but not 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 least I'm going to show this is another heart ring and uh, I think this is this my my dad gave it to me he, he bought it from somewhere I don't know hey it look, looks very nice and plus it has a story so most of the times, jewelry is important, no doubt, but all of my jewelry has some sort of, you know, uh, story attached to it. That's what makes it more special. So uh, two more things I'm going to share with you. These are not uh, jewelry pieces. These are uh, uh, some, what do you call it, what you attach here on your, um, yeah, these are badges basically. So this is from a Rotary Club. I used to be a member in a Rotary Club in Pakistan and... Uh, uh, when you become a member you get these this badge so this is what i got uh, uh, from rotary and this is what i got from uh, national security workshop uh, okay so this is a course at national defense university and it's related to uh, national security so when i was attending it uh, this is the badge i got because once you have so yeah i have a few badges now Let's see how many badges. Now I would think about getting, uh, collecting more badges. So here is my uh, jewelry collection. I hope I didn't miss uh, any of my jewelry. Uh, yes, I did. This ring, it's a solitaire ring. And uh, I got it from Tesoro. And it also looks very nice. And, uh, you know, it's not a diamond ring, but it's a, very, a little pricey. And a uh, very classy ring. It's a sil sterling silver. And this last ring which I'll show you, I got it from uh, Marie. There's a shop in Marie uh, who he sells the original stoned jewelry. His jewelry is very expensive. Uh, he has nice pearls, emeralds and you know lots of stones but his jewelry is guaranteed would never go black. 
And to be honest, I've been wearing this for like uh, three, four years now. And the stones stay same shiny and it's same silver. It has not changed even an inch of the color. So yes, uh, I wear it a lot because it looks very, very um, uh, stylish. And the, the stone is really shiny and uh, I wear it a lot. All right, here we come to the end of this video. Uh, I really enjoyed uh, making this video uh, because first, I love talking to you. Secondly, I found my Chanel earring. Uh, and uh, lastly, uh, it helped me organize my uh, jewelry as well. So now I have everything, you know, in place. So <laughs> thank you so much. And uh, let me know if you have any comments, any questions or anything you want to share about jewelry, makeup, jewelry mostly because right now we are doing the jewelry video and uh, i'll come uh, to you with a, another video another exciting video uh, and exciting up shop and exciting talk with you and uh, let me know if you have any questions and uh, like the video if you uh, enjoy the content and um, i love you all see you in my next video